let's do some skincare skin fix foaming oil cleanser i don't know what happened but yesterday when i was doing my skincare in the morning i felt like a little bit of tingling right around mostly my top lip and today when i woke up the whole top lip area was super dry flaking and tight it kind of felt like my skin does when i have a really bad allergic reaction it feels like it gets swollen and cracks and then it's just dry but i don't remember having an allergic reaction or a reaction to anything at all so it was just super weird my skin is still a little bit sensitive around here so just trying to be careful today's supposed to be an arousal day and i am still going to use it i'm just going to be careful about not getting it anywhere near my mouth Prequel Universal Skin Solution. Always let it dry. Sometimes you smell a fragrance and you're not super captivated by it the first time you smell it, but then you come back to it and there's something that just completely grabs your attention and that's what happened to me today. I have a sample here and the fragrance in question is Vanille Des Afriques from Ormond Jane. This is what I call an old money vanilla. It doesn't smell like a cupcake. It doesn't smell like icing sugar. It doesn't smell like creme brulee. It doesn't smell like ice cream. This has orris, osmanthus, pink pepper, coriander, carrot seeds, vetiver, musk, cedar. It's earthy. It's powdery. It's airy. It's woody. There's a little bit of spice and there's something about it that I just completely love now. I'm from Mugwa Essence. I also have this random breakout right here. I have no idea what caused that. It literally just popped up in the middle of the day today. Mirad Cellular Hydration Repair Serum. I always use this on my Razzle days. I've said it so many times, but I really feel like it helps prevent irritation. I'm gonna let this dry down before I go in with my Arazzo, but just to protect this area here, I'm gonna go in with my moisturizer right now, right here. This one is the Anua Intense Calming Cream. I'm gonna take a little bit. I'll do my chin too. I try not to put Arazzo on my chin. I do it by accident, but I try not to because I do get perioral dermatitis and sometimes retinoids can trigger that. My nose is also a little bit dry, so I'm gonna skip my nose. Basically, I'm gonna try to stay away from this area here. I love this perfume. Time for a Razzlo. Taking about this much. I'm just gonna spread that all over my face. I wasn't gonna put it on my nose. As long as I stay away from here, I'm good. Gonna let that dry down now. By the way, I got that sample at Centrique. I picked up four samples the other day. Two of them are Ormond Jane, Vanille des Afriques, Tanger, which is like a tangerine kind of scent. It's really, really pretty. Nishane Annie X. I like Annie X more than I like Annie. And Zerjoff Shincoin. So freaking good. Zerjoff actually didn't release the notes for Shincoin, so you kind of really just have to smell it and see what it smells like to you. I fell in love. I know I say that a lot, but if you are into fragrance, you know what it's like to fall in love with a lot of fragrances. This one is just super unique i find let me know if you want a video on it now i'm gonna go in with moisturizer on the rest of my face it's a little bit tricky because i don't want to end up spreading it all over i really just have to do it in small areas to make sure that i don't just end up spreading the arousal to the areas that i don't want it to be on skincare done as always if you have any questions let me know in the comments